Hi Aries, this is Jackie Tama and this is your general reading covering the entire month of April 2017 and don't forget to check out your weekly videos as well. This Sunday the 26th in the afternoon I will be on YouTube live so I hope you will stop by. I will be posting the time on my Twitter which will also post to my website. The website is www.ms-swami.swami Dot com and you'll find a link to that below these videos and if you're looking for a personal reading best time to catch me 1 p.m. to 1 a.m. Okay, so Aries a lot of positive energy around you guys for the month of April, which is good news uh, But one thing that is coming through is there is an unexpected offer or unexpected assistance coming in um, It looks like you are positive you're hopeful you're really working on some personal goals, um, some of you career goals, but a lot of you some personal goals. Uh, some good times, there's some, some celebrations there. And for a lot of you, a trip out of state. So let's take a look. This is for Aries for the entire month of April 2017. Okay, Aries, we start with the Major Arcana of Justice, the Ten of Wands, the Five of Pentacles, Major Arcana of the Lovers, the Three of Cups, and the Seven of Swords. So let me break these down for you and I'll pull three more for you. Um, starting with, this looks like with the Justice card, this is actually, to me, it's more or less for a lot of you, a purchase. The signing of a contract, so something significant. It could be the signing of a lease, um, a car, something big, something substantial. Um, if that doesn't apply to you guys, it does show that justice is being served and that things do go to your favor. The Ten of Wands shows you are overcoming your obstacles. You're pushing them to the side now. So it's kind of like the worst is over for you guys. The Five of Pentacles indicates that the, although the things are going good and you're, uh, you're in a good spot, it still shows that right now there is a little bit of financial stress going on as well. Now moving forward, we have the Lovers, we have the Three of Cups, and we have the Seven of Swords. And this is actually a pretty unique combination okay the lovers for you guys out there that are single my single aries this is a good month for new opportunities and uh, new connections okay for those of you that are in a couple relationship it does look like good communications going on and then here's that celebration i was talking about now with this celebration, uh, maybe someone in your circle or whatever, what we have here is someone that I'm going to call a sneaky person, okay? This is someone being deceitful. This is someone not telling you the entire truth. Someone, um, the type of person, you know, that's friendly to your face and then talk about you behind your back. That seems to appear with that celebration. So please be mindful of that as you go through the month. Now, moving forward, we have the Page of Pentacles, we have the Two of Wands, and then we have the Two of Pentacles. So, great month, guys. Uh, two of Pen uh, Page of Pentacles, where I was talking about, there's still some financial concern. It looks like as the month progresses, you get a little bit more of a handle on that, maybe make some payment arrangements, something that puts you back into that comfort zone, okay? The Two of Wands shows that's where you're working on your goals. You know, you're looking at where you're at. You're seeing what you can adjust. Uh, but definitely areas you're working on your personal goals this month. The Two of Pentacles. <clears throat> juggling too much on your plate. I can tell you guys, first of all, in your personal life, there's a lot going on and uh, a busy schedule. Okay. But it also says, shows that you're still kind of juggling things financially. So not financially perfect, but overall a really good month. So major arcanas for the month of April. Justice being served or a large purchase, good communications in the love life for both singled and the couples out there. So thank you guys for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. And if you get a chance, stop by this Sunday. Bye.